Hey YouTube family, how's it going? Today we have something really special and really different in this episode. Today I go out with two other YouTube channels. I go out with the uh, Slippery Beast channel with Julio and his son Michael. And I go out with Extreme Outdoors Junior and this huge 40 foot beautiful boat. And they take me out sword fishing. Something I've never done before, something we've never shown you before on our channel. So I think, I really think you're gonna enjoy it. So follow us on this extreme adventure. We had an awesome, awesome day, and watch this. You get two blondies. You get twins today. Look at that. It's the Barbie twins. The swordfish today. This is actually Slippery Beast <clears throat> waiting to happen right there. Slippery Beast in the making right there. So, and they beautiful. This guy knows how to make it happen. Oh, yeah. I don't know anybody who can do it, but this guy's amazing. So, I'm happy to be out here watching and learning. And, uh, He's got an excellent, excellent channel, the Slippery Beast YouTube channel. Yes, sir. Slippery Beast Fishing Channel. So make sure and you uh, hook them up. You're going to see some awesome fishing on there. These guys have amazing videos. They're about to explode, I think, out there on YouTube. All right, follow us. It's going to be an amazing day. I can't wait to see what this guy pulls out of the water today. The show, show them how to, how this bait swims. Show them how that bait swim. Yeah, let's see the bait swim. Dropping it now. Are we on the bottom yet or what? We're on the bottom. Okay. So what we do is we're, we drop the 12 pound weight down to the bottom of the ocean. We're at 1,700 feet of water. And we're gonna bring it up about 150 feet of water from the bottom. So we don't get the snag with the with the, uh, with the the rocks and stuff down there. The and then all we gotta do now is wait for the bite. And eventually, not too long from now, we're gonna bring out the Cuban pastelitos, the guava and cheese pastelitos. That's when everything starts happening. There we go. You know what I mean? Are you ready, uh, Dad? For this is why I came. I came. I came for the pastelitos. I came for the pastelitos. And to listen to him, because oh, I, mean, well, I mean, you know, it's like music. He's got, he's got his voice is like music. I, I tell you what. I tell you what. <laughs> uh, I don't put no names on anybody here, but Dan has got the plan. No, I got, no, I got no plan. I got no plan. <laughs> Only plan I got is to stay dry. <laughs> That's good. So everybody's completely fixated on the rod right now. Everybody's watching that rod tip. And when that thing goes down, we know the deal. It's still, it's still like my rod. Basically, you can even... While we're drifting for the swordfish, we've also got two flat lines out. So a great idea. 
idea on your boat, if you're offshore, is to take a, uh, a whole squid and put it on out, just on the flat line, out on the drift. And then we've got a live pilchard also out on these two rods. So there's the one with the, uh, that one has the squid. And this one right here has the live pilchard. And uh, who knows, you never know, big mahi, uh, kingfish, tuna. So it's going to be a very exciting day. I'm very happy to be here. Pasta litos in the morning. This is what makes the fish come, so to speak. Well, what kind of pastelitos is that? Uh, that guava. It's got to be guava. Guava and cheese. And cheese. You can't have... Doesn't get any better than that. Guava and cheese. Have, uh... mm. oh, it's a big fish. We got a fish it's on. It's up the weight. We got a fish on. It's swimming we up the weight. We got the weight coming weight. up. And we got no we balance on the rod. We, we, we got a fish on. We got fish on. Fish on. From the top. He's a big fish like swimming to the top. Okay. So does he know he's hooked yet or no? He, of course he knows he's, he knows he's dragging down 12 pound weight. Where we got he's more guys? Got, got it. Need the harpoon. Did you hear that? We need the harpoon. <laughs> that shit's getting real right now. literally hand lining this swordfish shit right now. I don't know how this is going to work. Yes, sir. Hey, we got the harpoon. We're not ready yet, but we got to try to jump now, and I don't want her to jump. She's going to look. When the line is over here, she's going to want to jump, okay? Just so you know, look. She's going to have to follow the line. She's going to want to jump right here. I'm, he's going to jump. He's going to jump. There he goes. Oh, yeah! Yeah! Woo! He just jumped. Yep. Right there, yep, I see him. Oh man. Oh! oh. 
that's a big one. Nice, nice fish. Nice He's fish. a beast. Oh, Mike, no, no, really? No, no, no. She's gone. She's gone. Still right there. Oh. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Nice, 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 nice. Keep her right here. Keep her right here. Yep, yep, yep. Go. Come on, Mike. Let's do it. Okay, get a gap on her. Come on. Come on now, Dan. Right here on this side. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. No. No, no. Okay, no. don't scare me like that. No, we good. We good. We good. On the front. Oh, shit, man. That's not good. We 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 good. Here she comes. Here she comes. Gaffer, gaffer, gaffer. Mike needs help. Mike needs help. Let's go. Mike needs help. Mike needs help. Gaffer. Gaffer. Woo! 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 Woo!
Can we put a gap through it there? We're gonna work. Got gaps on it or what? Oh shoot. Where the hell is she? Uh, oh shoot. Yeah. Uh. She's right there, she's right there. Oh shit, out there. Come on, come on, come on. Get her, get her, get her. There you go! Yeah. You got one? Hoo-ah! Yeah. Stop! Ha! Dead to me! Dead to me! Dead to me! Save the day! Save the day! Oh, oh. Yeah. Save the day! Oh, hey. What's up? Oh. <laughs> trying to deliver the gas! What did I say? What did I say? What? He tried to yeah. He tried to touch us. Woohoo! Let's go! <laughs> Alright, help you up. Sorry, little buddy. <laughs> but not I'm really. Gonna, I'm gonna cut this off so for a second. <laughs> Dan, you got Dan, it. You bro. guys are awesome. You good? Yep. Whenever you're ready. Oh, we have a door. She just wrapped just herself, wrapped wrap herself, wrap wrapped herself. Wrap wrap yeah, so just as, as 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 we hit the pause button or the stop button and we stop recording, she the fish literally just I don't know what she did. She was snagged, mangled up the bait, came loose, and got away. Last final drop, guys. I, I guess you know we got, we, we are truly blessed. We still got two fish on the boat. Yes, sir. Two fish. Two awesome fish on the boat, and it's been a very exciting day. Well, we just finished serving up, and and can you guess why we're separated? Can you guess why we have a separate oh, side? Oh, let me guess. One was a pumpkin. Yes, sir. And the other was a normal sword fish. A clear cut pumpkin. Ooh. Like, I think we should actually show the viewers the difference between a pumpkin and a regular swordfish. Okay, see what you can tell. And them raw. Okay, what's what and who's who? Oh, oh, there's a big difference there. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. The pumpkin sword. That's the one that eats 95% of his diet is shrimp. Yeah, the shrimp. Turn. So it, it tastes four times even better than this. This is amazing. <laughs> so you will not find this in a restaurant, in a fish market, because the, the commercial fisherman who catches this is going to keep it for his house and his family. Pumpkin on this side? Oh. Gray on this side. Oh, nice oh. Wait, which one? That's the pumpkin? That's pumpkin. Okay, let's do Once this. Once they're cooked, they almost look the same. They yeah. almost look the same. That's why I kept them segregated mm -hmm. so that we could know. Yeah. Yeah. The taste yeah. test. Taste we don't want to mix the pumpkin. No, of course. Rip a piece. No, I, no, no, I think it's only fitting if you do it. <sighs> okay, I will. Let's eat, Mike. I will. Look at this. Look at this big, juicy yeah, pumpkin yeah. sort of This is pumpkin. This is my first taste of my whole life of pumpkin sort of what seasonings do we put on these? So we use complete seasoning from Badia oh and god. Everglades Heat. Yeah, it's good. Oh my god. Is that the regular or the, the, the pumpkin? pumpkin oh my. So I've been fishing for a long time and that was probably the most exciting fishing trip I had ever, ever been on. And different. We were more near Miami than we were near Key Largo. We were in 2,000 feet of water. It was just an incredible day. A fishery that I've never experienced before and I was excited to do it. Many, many, many thanks to Extreme Outdoors and Junior and to the Slippery Beach Channel with Julio and Michael. Thanks so much for showing me the way and making this happen. It's, uh, it was just, just an amazing, exciting day. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, thank you so much for watching. We cannot thank you enough. Uh, we've grown exponentially over the last few months. So keep liking our videos, keep subscribing, and we'll keep making them. Follow us.